For more than two years now, residents at Cedar Glen Apartments in South Bend have run into the same issues. No hot water, no heat, and no communication from the property owners on when repairs will be made. Residents today tell me it's the same problem that begins around this time of year. Now there's a new problem, a major leak from a broken heater in one unit stairwell. You can see in video right here how bad that leak was as the carpet is soaked and going into people's apartments. One resident President tells me it's all promises from the property with no action. If they keep on promising us we're going to have hot water, hot water, mm -hmm. hot water is a necessity 365 days a year. Yeah. Yeah. But this heat, they need, they should have bled the lines and everything long time long before October. I also spoke with Portage Township's legal counsel, Alex Bowman, who's able to help residents with habitable housing. The council also got Indiana Attorney General Todd Rokita involved. Rokita and property owners Barrett and Stokely reached a three-year agreement for Cedar Glen residents, which awarded them $10,600 divided among affected residents. Bowman tells me because the attorney general is involved, there's not much he can do. So to the extent that there is a um, that there's substantive evidence of a breach of that agreement, that's something that um, in the attorney general's hands. Residents tell me they're worried this will be the same situation as they've seen in the past. Yes, I do. I and that's not fair to me, to everybody else out here, especially the people who have kids, little babies. It's not fair. It's not right. Thanks for watching. Here's another story you may like and subscribe to the WSBT 22 YouTube channel.